Well, actually, Ken, I've always pictured, I've always had just ideas. Ideas kind of come to me and they just pop in my head. And it works really well when you're working with authors, especially debut authors, because a lot of um, authors who who write their first book, they, they just say, okay, I wrote my first book, I'm done. And then they say, and I said, well, who's going to read this book? And they say, everyone, definitely not the answer you want to hear. So the first thing an author needs to do is define their audience. And once they define their audience, then I can work with them. And I w have worked with authors from the ages of 26 to almost 100. And I've worked with more than 100 authors. And um, I've worked with lay people, religious people, married people, divorced people, parents, single people, and uh, books on all the gamut and uh, all different subjects, fiction, nonfiction, children's books. And it's just about finding the right idea, the right market, and the right audience. And it, it's not difficult. It's just you got you to put yourself out there. Um, basically, it, the thing to say to an author is, you can hire a publicist, you can hire a lot of people to market your book, but unless you're willing to, to work with them and do a lot of the work yourself, your book is not going to market itself. It's not going to go out on the market and say, become a bestseller overnight. There are no, um, I love, oh, who's the guy who does um, Rich Dad, Poor Dad? Oh, uh, Kiyosaki? Yeah. He says there are no best writing authors. There are only best selling authors. And I love that quote. I love that quote. And if you want your book to sell, you have to, you have to work at it. And um, it's best to consult others and, and get out there. And I see so many people with success stories here. And it's just, I, I guess my typical success story is educating, especially debut authors on the things that, putting them in a realistic frame of mind because you want them to stay positive, but you also don't want them to be um, delusional, but you also want to help them because a, a lot of things are very, very simple and they're very, very easy. And people just don't know the little tricks here and there. And um, I had one debut author who um, had a family crisis six weeks before her book was to come out. And remember to call me on the day of the crisis and tell me that she couldn't appear on TV. And when I found out what happened, I was like, why, how would you even remember to call me? And um, her book, because of some of the marketing tips that I gave her and she utilized three years later, I think still remains a number one. Um, it's usually in the top 10 best selling in her category.